Hey, my Capricorns. Capricorns. How are y'all doing? I'm doing splendid. Wonderful. Marvelous. Capricorns. I've been having like a lot of downloads once again. But these downloads is kind of warning downloads. Um, This is for, it could be masculine, feminine, mother, father, uncle, cousin. Listen, right now it's a lot of trafficking going on um sex trafficking organ trafficking kidnappings a lot of people think when somebody kidnaps a kid the first thing they think is sex all the time which it can be you feel what i'm saying nine times out of ten but they also still in people organs people that's healthy young um a lot of people don't think that every person that's young is healthy because that's not always the case you feel what i'm saying but they don't know that until after they still in organs um so my thing if you like our teenagers or young children like i see like i don't know what be going on but my mom took me to school all the way to i was crying for her not to take me no no i think the fifth grade and a lot of people i see just like their kids just go i don't know but you, you each to their own but I would, rec I would recommend you give your kids some type of mace or something. I know they said they can't take it to school, but it's just like nowadays, like what do they have to protect themselves? You feel what I'm saying? It's just crazy out here. Um, You also got to make sure that you could trust your family, which you can't. You can't trust nobody. You feel me? I went through something with my child, my daughter, which is now 23. And something was going on with her. So she was a child by her own father side of the family i don't really talk about it much because i had to heal from it you feel what i'm saying but they was doing things on their weekend they had my child even though i was trying to tell the courts i didn't want them to have her on the weekends this and that another the judge ruled that because they is you know dad whatever they and grandma they could get 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 your child and you know shit going on you feel what i'm saying so like it was a long process you know and you have a lot of people that you know, act like they was there. I dealt with a lot. Like, a lot of people think I don't know. Like, right when I was going through the trial and, like, situations in that note when I wasn't really fully healed where I'm living, where I'm living, I heard a lot of couple little things or whatever. But at the end of the day, um, my daughter went through something. You feel me? I was a real mom. I wasn't on nothing. I wasn't really worrying about running the streets and doing this and doing that and all of that. So, like, at the end of the day, some things happen to good people. Whereas, though, you got people that you like, damn, this motherfucker doing this, this motherfucker doing that, and nothing goes on. But a lot of people, they hide, you know, things that go on in their life because they want to look sedidity. And they're not sedidity. You're not bougie. you just a regular motherfucker person from a hood, like, acting like that you didn't never go through nothing in your life. Like, everything was a hunky dory you feel what i'm saying that the people that you want to stay away from you know what i mean because people that's hunky dory never went through nothing they just so perfect their family is so perfect everything is so perfect they the ones that's not perfect you feel what i'm saying and they can't let their little fantasy and illusion crumble in front of their eyes you feel what i'm saying you get me you get my drift so like you want to stay away from that energy so I'm able to talk about it and not be in pain. I'm able to move forward. You feel what I'm saying? I'm not going to say I don't think about certain situations, but that's past in my life. You feel what I'm saying? And I'm able to talk about it. You know, I don't think right now that I'm able to fully do what I was trying to do. Um, far as I want to be a hundred percent mentor for children that was a victim of some type of sexual assault, some type of trafficking, because it's not hard on just the, the victim, the survivor. I'll change that. We all survived through it. You feel what I'm saying? Um, I went through a lot with that. I, you know, I had a, a, a minor heart attack. I went through a lot. You feel me? And I upcome a lot. You know, I wasn't driving for like, I think a year or two when I don't know what people was thinking, but I had not been cleared to drive. So I wasn't driving when I first got here. It was a lot I was dealing with because the doctor was like, I'm not signing that. And eventually I got well, my test came back, they signed me and I'm back driving. You feel what I'm saying? Only wasn't driving for a year. But when people don't know you and they see you, you know, not driving or something like that, they always think, oh, da, 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 instead of, you know, minding their business or like you know what i mean being there 
fully. People front like they be there for you. You know what I mean? This is literally for all signs. You know what I mean? And the the, the try to if if they not trying to hook you up on some type of drug because they see you at your weakest point because that's what people do. So I see when they act like they there for you, they're not really there for you. They they thinking you a weak link and like oh I could get this person to do this or get this person to do that or I could use this person. But at the end of the day, dependent on a person, you stronger than the fuck they could ever imagine. In my case, you feel what I'm saying? I would never put nothing up my nose. I would never hit a motherfucking pipe. I would never be using no motherfucking cocaine. I would never be using no motherfucking wet. And I would never be rolling the Dutch. Okay? And I would never be ejecting my motherfucking self with any motherfucking needle for any motherfucking thing. I don't give a fuck what I go through. And I've been through some shit. Okay? That shit, to me, I'm just too pretty for it. And I feel as though that shit takes your prettiness right the fuck away. It fucks with your mouth. It fucks with your health. It fucks with your brain. It fucks with your overall character. Bottom fucking line. That's me. Some people, they ain't think of that. You feel me? I wasn't. I just wasn't. Yeah, I used to drink when I was younger and shit. But the fuck? I got like, what? 15 bottles in this bitch? I don't even drink on occasion like that. I mean... I drink on occasion, but I really don't. Like, summertime, yeah, I want to mix my drinks because, like, I got cleared from the, etern the um, terminal illness I had. So, I couldn't drink like that, even though I was. I was taking, like, chances. Like, you know what I mean? That I shouldn't have been taking, but I wasn't really drinking every day. But I wasn't supposed to drink nothing. Now, I could, I'm could. i open to, I could, like, literally sit and have me some drinks. And don't got to worry about, like, this and that. You know what I mean? Mixing up with medicine and this and that. I'm good. You feel what I'm saying? And the only person that brought me through that was God, the divine. Because with God, listen, with God, everything prevails the way it's supposed to be. Every challenge, every difficulty... Every backstab, every gossip word, every hate, every lie was put in front of you because it was a test for you to pass so the divine could bring you to where you need to be. Your calling, okay? We have a calling regardless you act like you don't have one or not. It ain't high and behind a religion where as though you fake as fuck. You know what I mean? That's not your calling. Your calling is when God called you to do your do, you're going to start doing your calling. It's motherfuckers that's 50, 60 years old that never had that calling. And they may not get their calling until it's late. Why? Because they ignore their calling. People ignore their calling. You feel what I'm saying? Until something bad happened in their energy. They awake the fuck up, especially the perfect people. <laughs> you feel what I'm saying? Motherfuckers that hide what really go on. You feel what I'm saying? Ain't nothing perfect. You feel what I'm saying? Bottom line, ain't nothing perfect. So with that Capricorn, I just want y'all to understand that don't let perfect people dim your light. You feel what I'm saying? Don't let so perfect Nothing goes wrong. Don't look at the next person because at the end of the day, either they doing something they don't supposed to be doing and they got a they got a reason why they doing it. Whatever. You got motherfuckers that sit and gossip as as much as they can and they fucked up. You got people that put people down that's on like section eight, or you got people that's not paying for rent. You got people that's getting assistance from other uh, other means when they mad because they don't get it. You feel what I'm saying? They mad they, they don't have it. Maybe they fucked up and they can't get this. Maybe they can't do taxes because they did so much fraud. You feel what I'm saying? So don't never down yourself for another bitch that's a bum bitch or a masculine because he probably living with somebody that's in low income. He's probably living with somebody that's paying $30 a month. But he's saying, oh, I don't want that type of person. I don't want this type of person. I don't want that type of person like you don't have no choices because do you have your own place and your own key to your own place are you driving your own vehicle or are you driving someone else's vehicle literally are you no are you fully in your religion or are you halfway in your religion or are you just in your religion when everybody else in the religion right so at the end of the day, don't let nobody dim your light. Don't let nobody put you down. Don't let nobody make you feel less than them. Like, don't let nobody think like, 
like a lot of people will be like, oh, they little, they ain't got nothing to worry about. Like far as being skinny, they may be skinny, but they probably got a big butt. No, butt, big tummy, wide in the back. And you like, damn, I can't lose my weight. I'm trying to lose my weight. I'm trying to be skinny. No, don't be skinny. Be what's good for you. You feel me? I always was a three, four, five, six. <laughs> Period. You feel what I'm saying? And like I was like, well, you wasn't stressing. You was just eating good. Yeah, I just was eating and having a ball. I care for it. I was I was I was balling. Yeah. And sometimes when you happy, you would gain weight. That's how it is. That's the saying. If you ever heard it, get fat and move to Florida when you retire. <laughs> yeah. That's some people. Some people gain weight when they're under stress. So like, don't be what somebody else is. Be what you is. You feel what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, like even men, you people be like. He ain't going through a lot. But some men, they lose their self. I lost my friend that was overweight. He had a heart attack. He was early 30s. You need to focus on you. Get your weight together. Because, like, being big, regardless what you're talking about, is not cute. And being skinny is not cute. Especially if you're not he healthy. Can you drop down, bitch, and give me 100 push-ups? Bitch, can you drop down and give me 50 crunches? Bitch, are you, can you can you do these lay, these these weight training um programs here? You got men that can't even lift over 150. So I just want you to know that, like, because they're a man, don't look at them like he could help you lift up a whole fucking gallon of liter of water. That motherfucker struggle, struggle to get bags out the car. <laughs> he not healthy. When the last time he went and got a checkup, is he eating right or if he's eating at the corner store every day? When he have his vegetables, is he pooping every day properly? This is what you need to worry about when you... Trying to downgrade yourself because you look at somebody and be like, damn, da 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 da, or this and that, that. Nah, you don't really know what's going on with that person because at the end of the day, that person is fronting about what's really going on. They're not trying to show you. Just like with sex and families and abuse and all this, they hide that within the families. And sometimes they get out and they don't want it to get out. Families knew what was going on with my daughter and they kept it combined shut. Nasty motherfuckers. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah, justice prevailed motherfuckers justice prevail but to me they deserve death bottom line was i doing my spells then i wasn't fully into what i'm into my energy wasn't clear my mind wasn't fully there so tarot wasn't a hundred percent there for me for you to do spells and stuff you have to be able to separate yourself from what's going on or you're not doing terror a lot of people do on tarot, and I don't know what they're talking about. Hey, each to their own. Some people just copying and doing what they're doing. This is my lifestyle. This is my job. I literally do my taxes on what I do. You feel what I'm saying? Plus other things I do. So don't never let somebody, what they pretend to be, downplay your life. You feel what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, the person that act like something they're not, that's that's not them. They wearing the mask. You feel me? They 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 front around people that they gotta that look up to them. You got motherfuckers look up to motherfuckers that's negative as hell. They looking up to them. Why the fuck you looking up to somebody that's doing some negative shit? And then he said this person supposed to guide you like yo. You got you a job. You shouldn't be on the block or you shouldn't do this. That's my energy. I wouldn't even be out like that. Not at all. What I mean, be out at all. You ain't your religion. You doing what you got to do. What the fuck is it to be around? What, the accidentally get killed or something? Like, what, I mean, what is it? That's my energy to my niggas. You feel me? My energy is not condoning bullshit. You feel what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, never look down or never pass judgment and think that this person got it better than you because they don't. Or this person work every day. You going through this and that. That person is struggling to pay that car note. That person is struggling to pay that rent. That person is struggling to have food in their house and buy the orders. They got to go to the corner store for everything. That's what they know. So don't think, oh, da 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 and this and that and other. You don't know what somebody is going through. Nobody knew I was fucking sick. You think I would tell these motherfuckers or anybody that I was sick? Hell no. Two people do. And my fucking kids didn't even know the last minute. And they ain't know the whole story. Why? Because you don't tell somebody when you down. You feel what I'm saying? Like, it's just different. It, it's it's like a different situation 
with people. You feel what I'm saying? Some people want to see you down. Some people want to see you sick. You feel me? Like, I wouldn't give a fuck about motherfucking faces. I know I ain't taking no disrespect for no motherfucking body at all. That shit is done, deal, period. Just stay the fuck away from me. That's from anybody, no matter what state you in, what state. I don't, like, that's not my motherfucking energy. And energy is something that's been out for years. People just start talking about energy. Like, sit the fuck down. You don't even know what energy is. You got different energies around you. You never at peace. Like, they dropping shit off in your house. They dropping shit off in your car. Like, you don't have no peace. You you, you literally in everybody else's energy. How you got peace in your life? That's why people so focus on what the next person doing. So people don't see them backsliding. Them getting notices and shit. Like, focus on you. You feel me? When you focus on you, I'm telling you, God gonna open them doors and make things right. And he's gonna bring them evil devil peasants down to your feet so you can see what's really going on. Because I know I see everything. Yeah, you feel me? Motherfuckers was lying to me. I own my house, so I do this. And I don't know why motherfuckers was fronting. Like, even when I meet people or talk to the people, they lie. And when they tell me where they live, I can go in a database. I'm a licensed realtor. You can't tell me anything. I, if it's not you, it's your dad's house, whatever. Like, I don't care, but why lie to me? Like, I ain't going to say we all won because we ain't right now because I know motherfuckers ain't on my level and I damn sure ain't on theirs. But we all living day to day. We all got our little struggles. We got things that we overcoming. But you got these motherfuckers that act like they Holly Berry or the low. And Holly Berry had shit she had to overcome. So, like, at the end of the day, don't let somebody, what they make themselves seem, dim your light. You feel me? So, we're going to go ahead and we're going to do us a read and see what's the energy. I'm going to tell you, these motherfuckers, they frauds. They ain't who they claim they be. Know that. Nobody can fraud me. I see shit for what it is. Hmm. You feel me, cat? Quiet season is over with this motherfucker. I just be looking like motherfuckers lie. For, motherfuckers are lie to you for years, yo. <laughs> That's just crazy, but it's but they lie for you for years, yo. That shit's deep. But they always switch up and they don't even realize it. Yeah, you could be coming up out of celebrating with people or dealing with a third-party situation or just coming up out of dealing with three people here. Like, you just like, man, listen, I'm just done dealing with this energy. Holy Spirit, what is the energy surrounding this reading? Yeah, you left three people behind. It could have been six, whatever it is. You come up out of celebrating with peasants. You move forward and left the past behind. Like, bottom line, you like, I'm done. You could be dealing with an air sign or water sign. That's how it is. Yeah, because you wasn't having no new beginnings. It was fucking up your money here. You got no love for the energy. You got no love for them. You see the peasants for the, what they are, peasants. Motherfuckers is crazy. King of Cups. Yeah, you knew they had a bunch of bullshit with them. And you knew they was liars with the Queen of Swords of Rush. You already knew all this. You feel what I'm saying? You had to go. And if you didn't have to go, this shit is coming to fruition. So the best thing to do is move forward. Move forward. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles. Your money could have been coming in really slow. Yeah, I see you waiting for your ships to come in. Yeah, you're not celebrating with these people. You wasn't celebrating, period, here. With the Page of Pentacles here, somebody had young type of money here. Yeah, you at peace now. Yeah, air sign energy, you at peace. A lot of people don't know what peace is. They'll never have peace. You feel what I'm saying? Never. Why? They don't know what peace is. Yeah. They not to be trusted. You feel what I'm saying? Knight of Cups of Verse. They not to be trusted. In the past, you was overthinking situations with people. You was taking chances with people. Basically, you was being a fool. Played like a fool. Yeah. You coming up out of overthinking shit now. Yes, you is. With the tower, it was a tower woman that hit your life. Sagittarius energy, you had to see what people really was about. And that's what you did, Sagittarius energy. You move fast away from them. I love it. You move so fast away from them. This will stick it out. Yeah, you come up, I don't feel like you ain't know which way to go or a wounded warrior. you like, mm, mm it was time to go. Yeah, that's how it be. It be time to fucking go. And you on that throne making your own shit happen with the queen of wands. 
Yeah, you was living in other people's illusions. That's how it be. You could be done with Scorpio Pisces. Yeah. I'm telling you. You come up out of having other people's shit on your back. You happy as fuck. With the King of Swords, you speak that truth and you cut them the fuck off. I love it. You could be dealing with a Leo air sign again. Yeah. Ace of Swords. It's the truth. The divine showed you they was liars. They was all liars. Like, bottom line, they was liars here. Justice is in your favor in this. Like, these motherfuckers was liars. You got your guard up now. You like, fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here, fire sign energy. You got a new beginning, divine, divinely guided. Like, the divine, like I said, I'm telling you, all you got to do is wait. Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn in the fucking building. You got other people sitting here trying to figure out how to get that dollar. You feel what I'm saying? You loving yourself, loving others in the divine. You the Ten of Pentacles because you left that bullshit behind. I mean, Capricorn. That's how it go. It was too many ups and downs with them fucking peasants here. They was like trying to have you anxiety here. Motherfuckers couldn't sleep when you came around. They was hiding shit from you here. They was hating, gossiping, telling lies on you here, spreading rumors about you here. And with the page of wands, all good news came to you. You got the right news for the right person. You feel what I'm saying? At the end of the day, you find out who the least person you thought was real is the realest of them all. Like, get the fuck out of here. Yes. Yeah, they was gaslighting you, manipulating you here. And you probably was doing black magic on them. I know the fuck I do. Yeah. You couldn't build your money up with these people with the death card. You ended it with these scavengers. Could have been a Scorpio. You a boss. Aries energy. They was mad as fuck. You come up out of putting yourself in a situation. Being stuck at other people's shit. You like, get the fuck out of here, bitch. Ah, they mad as fuck. Yeah, with the King of Pentacles, you could be dealing with an Aries. You could be dealing with another Capricorn. Yeah, or this could even been you. Yeah, it was a fell victory with them. You feel what I'm saying? But it was a towel moment. It was needed. You had to go in a whole nother direction. Bottom line, you had to. You're like, this shit ain't working for me. Holy Spirit, what is the energy surrounding this read? Like, you, this is what you had to do. Yeah. Now you got the whole world in your hands now. Divine wasn't blessing you with all these motherfucking peasants around you? Gossip and lies? Yeah, they, they coming up out of They can't plot on you no more. They couldn't defeat you anyway. They was teaming up on you. They was trying to leave you for dead with the Ten of Swords. Yeah. The world, you close the cycles and now you happy and you just dancing. You feel what I'm saying? Queen of Pentacles once again. Yeah. Bossing. You like, get the fuck out of here. Bitch. Masculine feminine energy. Yeah, page of cups. They was fake as fuck. Water sign energy. Yeah. And your emotions attack, you get all your wishes fulfilled now. Why? Because you seen the light at the end of that tunnel. Yeah, you couldn't build nothing with them motherfuckers, yo. Nothing. Not even having them around you. Yeah. They could have been stealing your energy. I'm telling you. Even stealing little shit from you. Yeah. You coming up out of having options. Why? Because you see everybody for what they are. They all spilt out. Could have been dealing with water signs too. Yeah, you left them right out in the fucker cold fucker. That's the energy you give them. And it's right to your happiness with the Ten of Cups. I mean, this reading was so beautiful. And it's like match what I said. It's like, I love the divine. I love my readings. Yeah, they got away with a lot of shit without you knowing. Snaking you here. High and shit. Yeah, they did. They did. They did. But at the end of the day, who got the last laugh? Holy Spirit, what is the energy surrounding this reading about these fucking snakes? Yeah, now you stay to yourself and you keep your business to yourself and your money to yourself. You come up out of devilish energy. You come up out of having stress for these peasants. Could be a Leo. Yeah, you could even lost a child. The Empress here, you wasn't maybe using your intuition when you was dealing with the Taurus. You come up out of having patience for these motherfuckers. They want to come back from the past back into your life now here. But you come up out of feeling like you trapped in wet in situations. you like, get the fuck out of here. You're cutting them all fast. you like, no way. You ain't coming back here. This is a one-way door, boo. Holy Spirit, what is the energy? This is one way out. Holy Spirit, what is the energy? Surrounding my ball fast Capricorn. The most hated. Yeah, they can't make nothing happen in your energy. You could be dealing with fire sign. It's like, it's over here. The truth has set you fucking free. Yeah. 
They only wanted handouts all the time. They always wanted something. You come up out of not knowing which way to go. These motherfuckers always wanted something from you, cat. Yeah, judgment is in favor of you leaving these motherfuckers. You were divinely guided. This was a test you had to pass. You had to pass this test because it was a lesson that was not learned. You couldn't build nothing. You couldn't work to your fullest potential. But luck is on your side now. Like this was a you you needed this. This was another this was another test. Like divine put you through this. And I know you like like for me. I'm like damn another test. I'm going through all this with my daughter and going through the, all the health. Like I could have died. Like I was unbalanced for me. You feel what I'm saying? Like, more tests. Listen. All you got to do is just stay to yourself and be quiet. A lot of people still can't turn their back on you. They fucked up. But at the end of the day, some people have more than one chance. Two strikes you out over here. People are stressing about things they lost. Or you. Yeah. Knight of Wands here. This is somebody that's flighty that's never here to stay. They like in and out of your life. It's like, it's like they come back in. There's always some shit and they go right back out. Fire sign energy. Sagittarius um, directly. I'm trying to fuck with grown ass men. I can't deal with little boys. Because they nothing but confusion. You be having people a fake competition with you. You like, what the fuck? They supposed to be friends and associates. You made that choice in your life. You could even been with a Gemini. You come up out of letting people hurt your heart. Third party interference. Third party situations. Like no, you come up out of their lives here. You a guru. They didn't even know what your guru is. A lot of people don't even know. I'm a guru, bitch. The whole time. I know somebody told me. I see you with the white people. They help you move in. They my friends. Like, friends. People don't know what friends is. Fuck out of here. Friends don't trust. Friends ain't. Listen, we're going to see what oracles come out. People who was worried, just worry about you so much. I'm trying to tell you, yeah. You got people worried about you so much, but it's all over now. You feel what I'm saying? Because you hold that motherfucker. What? That throne. <laughs> that throne. Holy Spirit, what is the energy surrounding my boss as Capricorns? The most hated. People thought they even knew your real age. <laughs> Bitch, I'm young. And I'm still bossing. They bad as fuck. I'll just tell people what I want them to do. I've been with like that all my life. Holy Spirit, what is the energy? <laughs> Woo, you got a lot. Okay. They will pay the high price for fucking with a Capricorn. Yeah. They not being real. Hmm. Throw on the Ray-Bans. I always do. <laughs> Fast pace. Predator energy. <laughs> Definitely I found out somebody was locked up for, for rape. What do you want? What they want you to know. You piss them off. Who gives a fuck? All I can say is fuck you. Take a walk with my strap. Car trouble. Aquarius really hate surprises. Their lips run a mile a minute. <laughs> Summer flame. That shit's over. Positive pregnancy test. Somebody may find out they was pregnant in the summer or you will be this summer. I know I won't. Pre-summer fling. Nah. They will never ever forgive you or you will never ever forgive them. I know. I forgive, but I won't forget and I'm good. Ain't this a bitch. Frozen. When I see Frozen, I'm thinking of Little Baby song. If you never heard it, go Google Little Baby Frozen. Bottom fucking line. Multiple gunshots <laughs> all the time. Ten steps ahead of them. Slow all the way down. Your future lover is an Aquarius. Uh, hope not. 
remember those days. I remember back in the day. I had so much fun in my in my in my time. Like shit is never be the same. Throw that ass back. Bounce, bounce, bounce. So yeah. Never let somebody dim your fucking light. You hear me? Never let somebody dim your fucking light. 